and welcome back guys we're gonna be playing some rust here now my base is definitely improved a little bit you might hear a little squeaking from my crappy chair that i need to replace but today we're gonna to be attempting to build a bridge now where we're we gonna build this bridge for all from here over to there and that's a nightmare base by the way we are on a roleplay server and a nightmare base decided to spawn right there i ain't doing that mm -mm. but where is AI Dark Angel located? They are located in D19. And the bridge is going to go from here over to C17. Can you imagine all the foot traffic for those that are going over here? If they're actually walking over here and go, oh, look, there's a shop over here. Uh, I'm going to try to put out now like a little roleplay village over here so people want to go to individual shops. Although I think most people are going to use the drone to go over here and stuff like that and not actually visit. But let's mess around and find out. Hope everyone's been enjoying the series so far. I started filming and I'm like, you know what? What are the rules of the server for streaming? And I went and looked them over. It says it's okay as long as you're not being toxic. I'm like, okay, sounds good to me. So I'm going to be teaching you guys how to build a bridge. Now I used to build these on the Dark Ages server. And, well, I, I clearly don't do that anymore. <laughs> So I want to make this where you could drive a car over it too. So I want to make this nice and low. We're going to make it too wide. Alrighty, so we've got the basics down now. So, now we need to put our scuba diving gear on. Oh, joy. Actually, I don't need this on yet. That's what I need. Ah, oh, shit. Change the physics a little bit. Might need multiple of these. And the goal is to just get across this as fast as you can. I love the sound of my mechanical keyboard. Surprised a shark didn't come over and eat me yet. Watching jinxing myself. Yep, that's pretty much how you build the bridge. But now we need to stone this up, which is going to be fun. Also, we need to figure out where we want it to no longer be maintained by one tool cabinet. So, let's go ahead and get that figured out. I'm going to say right in the middle, half and half. Like right here. So it would have been made more sense if I left a TC. So let's go make a TC. So we want 
Did the cutoff about here. We're gonna do a ramp here. So building a tool cabinet should be like right here. These two squares are going away, and then right here should be the next triangle. These tool, tool cabinets, or triangles, will be the things that keep this bridge going. Oops, I don't want to... These things up there, but it's fine, I can make it live. I can work with it. So yeah, we're going to have a bridge right here, and in between these two points, we're going to be able to um, be in th be, with these two points here, we're going to be able to, you know, have a bridge. Bridge good. Go ahead and put a little bit of stone in here, like that in there. 20 days, wow. Keep, keep up. I'm actually gonna break this. I'm probably gonna move this part to be down here more. Yeah, I'm gonna put it like right here. <sighs> of course you had to build right there. Like seriously. We'll see if I can break it. Oh uh, no. <laughs> so one of the lovely things about building a bridge, sometimes this can happen where... Oh wait a minute, no, no, it's because the waves. Give it a second. Gotta wait for the waves to go away. There we go. <laughs> I was about to be like, really? You kidding me? I was about to be very salty. So now, I'm going to go back to the base and get stone. Still going to need a crap ton of wood. But I'm going to upgrade the, um, the foundations. 
so we can get that squared away. I had someone make me a new banner for the channel, but I have to get them to refit it because it's too wonky at the moment. What about sulfur? Nothing to use it on. So why am I doing two TCs instead of one? Yes, it would be easier to do one TC, but to make it so that you don't have to maintain it as much, it's probably better just to do multiple TCs. I was thinking about doing like four TCs for this one, but I'm like, eh, I'll keep it down to two, it's easy. It looks so weird. It looks like it's not. It looks like we're doing like an L turner. So I'm making this bridge where it's friendly to subs for those that buy subs. You never know. We're making it too wide so you could drive a car over this if you really wanted to. I don't know how the hell you're going to get up the ramp, but... You can. I used to build like giant RP towns and stuff like that on the old dark on uh, a different server. Try not to use the server name. I don't think the server exists anymore. Like all the anchor communities left it from what I was told. So you kinda see what's going on with that. Trying to buy by the rules. Streaming gets me into trouble sometimes. How does it get me into trouble, you ask? Well, some people take it the wrong way. Being a streamer, it's got its gifts and its curse. Same thing with me playing VR chat. It's got its gifts and curses. That's why I'm like, you know what, I need a break from VR chat. Oh, thank God, someone's trying to nightmare buddies. lower expenses, we are going to do a bunch of these. Ooh, 
Oops, that's not what I want to do. Should not take too long. I am going to have to put more stone upkeep in the TC there. Bridges are expensive, <laughs> which you may have noticed. So yes, cars can get through this, even though the water is coming over this, they can still drive, surprisingly. To prevent water from going over your bridge, all you have to do is raise it up by a little bit. So this server is about two week wipe. Make sure that this becomes boat friendly. We're gonna go this, 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 this. We're gonna rotate the roof and do this. Then we just need to set up the um, bridge stuff for the other side there. Pretty much. For that. And then we gotta connect the bridge over to that. Get that side set up, and we're ready to rock and roll, basically. Hopefully this is entertaining for you. Alright, let's do the other side. I don't think I have enough stone. Let's go ahead and find out. Yeah, I would make bridges to islands and stuff. That's amazing. And then I got screwed over by my previous teammates. They're like, hey, we found a new guy. I'm like, okay, you have fun with that new guy. The uh, guy I was replaced with basically is a douchebag. <laughs> They found out real quick that he was found taking stuff from their base and putting in another base. He didn't last very long in their group. And then they begged me to come back, and I'm like, mm, oh no, you were quick to yeet me out of your group. <laughs> yeah. I'd make the list of what needs to get done every day. Okay, this needs maintenance, this needs upkeep. <laughs> You want to go raiding, go raiding, but you do need to help in main building upkeep, or base upkeep. I have a feeling I should put side pieces on this so that people can see where they're driving. Oh, I 
Let's see what happened. Okay. This is actually pretty easy to fix, guys. So, for some forsaken reason, it twisted here. This triangle was supposed to be attached to here. But that's alright. We can fix that. That's pretty easy. Can't believe I did that. Alright. So this just requires me to go get more stone and wood. That's actually pretty simple to fix. I have to do is slash remove this and build on the existing frame. It's pretty it's easy to fix. I was like, that doesn't look right. For a while now. Right. right. <laughs> Uh, well, it just proves that it's been a while since I built a bridge. It's been a while. So now you know why I haven't really been uploading much lately. I've been taking a break. I needed a break. Give me a break. Give me a piece of that. Get that ball. You know what? Let me go put the weapon inside too, so that I have more space. Because it's going to give me resources back here too. I still have to set up the farm, the water purification systems, like, I still have a lot to do. But yeah, I'm spending my time to build the bridge. One of the reasons is I want the trees and stuff from over there. That's one of the reasons of why I'm doing the bridge. Also, there seems to be enough foot foot traffic over here where people are swimming across the river here. So, mm. I need to turn on my chat. Just remove. However, if you're on a server that does not have slash remove, make sure that you build everything out of twig first, and then upgrade it. Make sure it's a nice straight line if you can. If you can't, you can't, you know. Easy fix. And of course, it's all in survival, which gives me extra credit. looks at me. How long did it take you to get all that? Oh, it only took me about an hour to get all that stone and wood. It's fine. The real challenge will be, if you're in a normal server, how much will it need to maintain this? That's a real question you should be asking yourself.
Well, maybe I will just make it one TC. It's being a putz. Usually you can make it two TCs, but I guess I'm making it one. We're finding out in this server what works and what doesn't. That's not working. There are ways to do it, but it's been such a long time since I've played Rust. way. I want to put lights on this bridge too. How do you make this where you could drive your car over it if you cannot get up this? Well, it's pretty simple. So if you can't drive your car up here, then it's actually really simple. Um, you can make the, the ramp higher. I'm probably going to make it higher. Just so that it can get over that. Cost ten thousand stone. Jesus. So I'm on a server that does not allow kill inside at all.
That's going to be where I put my cars. But I might actually extend that. Because I want to put planters in here. That's what I want to do. This back wall here is going to be storage. Actually, it's going to be vending machines. But yeah, you kind of get the idea. <laughs> Mandy's no. So now, I'm going to show you why I'm not too worried about. Why I'm not worried about the uh, need of stone. It, it, there's so much around here, it's amazing. It's amazing. Save me grace. Hallelujah. Look at me, what the fuck? <laughs> so, this is going to the tool cabinet up there. I need to go grab me a gun. lights on that too so I think I'll buy me another test Jenny I'll build a little housing just for its lights there I've got to research the smart switch but once I do all that stuff this is pretty much done I mean I might raise it up maybe another level just so cars can travel on this without having to go up the little um, over the little ramp I don't think a four-seer or four-module car can go over this. Three days. <laughs> Why are you decaying? Oh, that's fine. Oh yeah, someone's tearing that raid base over there, a new one. Alrighty. So now I'm going to show you why I'm not worried about stone. You're like, you should be worried about the amount of upkeep of that. I'm not worried about that. And I'll show you here in a second. I wish it was a nicer day. It's a good location. Why? Well... I've got this right here. I can farm scrap all the way down here. There's a recycler here. Or I could farm scrap all the way down here. Or I could farm scrap going up here. I, what I like to do is I like to start down here, go down all the way down here, go to the outposts, go all the way up here, sneak all the way around, and go back this way and scrap everything. And then I like to go back this way, anything that's respawned, and then go back down this road, scrap everything, then go back home perfect location although someone's built their base around here so I'm just like it's gonna screw up the uh, things that spawn for getting scrap <laughs> it's like hey stop it uh, also someone built the base over here this is where I like to farm stone it's gonna screw up the nodes locations but uh, it's took good they're gonna learn the hard way right I'm mostly after stone. Not too worried about it. Sure you want to. 
did not know who we were messing with. Travel over here. It was fun. The uh, last map that I joined on, I originally joined on a friend. I'm like, oh look, they have the game Rust. I haven't seen them on here playing it. All right, let me go see how they're doing. Yep, they got me back into playing Rust. <laughs> well, I, I stopped playing it after my uh, group. Locked me out in the cold. The, the group I was playing Rust with for over probably four or five years just ditched me over this new guy that they think was funny, which actually just the guy was just down stealing their stuff. Eh. And now the group really doesn't play Rust at all. It's only one or two people I actually get on to play and it's like, eh. wow, that group really fell apart quick. Yeah, I like going back here and farming. Although it looks like someone farmed all the stone nodes maybe, or maybe it's the nodes messed up again. Um, so it's very important to mine all nodes in the general location. So if you're going to go farm like a stone node or something like that, farm everything in the area. So it's fun to uh, why? Because if you just pick out what you want, it leaves all the stuff that you, know, you didn't farm. Yes, there's a consequence for not farming everything in the general. Not bad at all. Oh, I can lift this. I can always go across the street and farm that kind of stuff there. Yeah, when it's night time, I'll end the video. So I don't, you don't have to sit there and endure being there for a good 25, 30 minutes of sitting there waiting for night time to go away. See large oil rigs from here. And the lights on. Um, what the hell? I've always made this jump in the past without no problem. I want to go up there next when I run out of nodes down here.
Sounds like someone made too big of a base over here. And it's having a hard time maintaining it. That's why all the stone is I can only speculate. Yeah, when I came over here, day one of wipe, all I saw was nodes, stone nodes everywhere. It looked like Kansas Mountain almost. Yeah, I'll build here. No one else will build it, right? That was wrong. Okay, there's a base right there. Ever since they put that base there, the nodes spawning in this area have been really messed up. Anyways, make sure you hit that like button, make sure you subscribe button. I'm gonna go farm and recoup all the stuff that I just used. Make sure there's plenty of upkeep for that bridge. I wanna make sure this is like uh, two weeks worth. So that's 10, 11, 12, 13, 14 days worth of upkeep I've gotta put in that bridge. I'm just gonna sit here on top of this twig for the night make sure you hit that lap button make sure to subscribe button i'll see you guys in the next video